All right, so we just did send email. Now show notification. Uh, notifications, we've been over many times throughout training, but it's just the notification comes into the notification panel, right? Um, if there's video associated with that notification, you can click on that video, pull it in. Uh, you can force it to be acknowledged before it goes away. Uh, so let's go over real fast how it looks in the UI. So if you open up your NX Witness client, right, and we go to that same exact rule motion, and we set it up. So when motion starts, I want to show a notification this time, right? Interval action can be instant or once per every minutes, what up to you guys. Um, you can also do force acknowledgement. We're going to do that right now. Force acknowledgement forces uh, the users who see some users who see that notification to respond to it with a bookmark, right? Before it will disappear from the notification panel. Okay, so we've got that set up uh, under global notifications. Uh, this is, takes you to the local thing, so you can enable and disable certain notifications. It's just a convenient place to put it. Uh, press apply when you're ready, right? So now if Nick goes for the kettlebell again, I've got a note notification here, right? If I click on it, it plays back that video for me. Um, and then if I go to acknowledge here, right, then I'm going to have to put in a bookmark. Nick stole my kettlebell, right? Okay. It's okay. He could use, use some lifting, right? Yeah, sorry, Nick. <laughs> so now I've got, I've acknowledged that and it's gone away. But then as well, um, you see your bookmark will appear uh, down in the timeline for when that actual event occurred, right? So there you go. Nick stole my kettlebell, right? So that's how you show notifications. Um, cool feature. I think you guys already get it.